Hello guys, my name is Khan and in today's video we will discuss that how we can combine multiple dimensions in Tableau. Uh, so, why, so by combining uh, different dimensions in Tableau we will create new variable or a new dimension in Tableau and then we will also discuss a bit few practical uh, examples behind that how you can use combine dimensions to make your analysis uh, a bit easier or so for this video i will be using again the same data so uh, so if you guys already have viewed my previous videos so you guys already know that mostly i use a hypothetical us census data so i will quickly go through this data it's a very small data so we have in this data this data is about usa only and and each row is representing each state and then i have some state too which is representing a short abbreviation of state then i have region variable then i have some demographical variables like death population marriage divorce in each year we collected the data then some date and status that the state is poor or rich again this is a hypoth hypothetical data i have nothing to do with reality uh, but I'm using this data. I have created this data for my videos. So I will be importing this data into Tableau first. So I will close this data now. And then I will go to my shortcut. So this is the Tableau shortcut which is I have in my desktop. I will click it. As I said that Tableau works in three steps. So whenever you are like to work in Tableau, you need to import data into Tableau. Uh, as my data is in Excel, so I will say Excel. This is the data that I have shown you guys. I will open it up. So the second step in Tableau is that you create your visualizations, and in the third step, you share your visualization with your users or with your audience. So I able to successfully import the data into Tableau in my sheet one. Now what I will do? I will go to my sheet one. So I will give you suppose give an example so suppose i am creating a variable so want to create a table region and within the region i want to show state and i want to see a region state i want to see uh, the population uh, within uh, this table so i will go and bring it here text so now you can see here that within each region is showing me this table is showing me what are the what are those states and then after that what's the population within each state but suppose if you want to sort this table and you want to see that you want to see all uh, those states uh, uh, first which have the highest population so suppose if i select this sub population and then i if i able to uh, sort it the important thing to note here is that what tableau have done is that it have sorted the data for each subcategory so you can say northeast is this and then it keeps on decreasing and for north central these are the states which have the highest population first and then keeps on decreasing but i want to see a i don't want to see based on each subcategory of region i want to see show me uh, uh, the information based on the overall data and it will also tell me that state and region uh, for for the highest population state so in that case the combine option become very important and how you can implement that combine option so if i go to my sheet 2 and now let's see if i combine my state and region first so first i click the region with region dimension then i have selected my straight region a state with uh, dimension and then if i right click it and then if i go to create under the create there is an option combine field so if i do that and now if i bring this combine field under my state rows now you can even see that it's showing me state and region you can even rename the variable if you want so it's showing me alabama and it's showing me the south alaska west arizona west so what's happening here is actually tableau have combined both of those two variables so I will quickly go to my data and I will show you what actually in the backend Tableau is doing. So I will just for my safety, I will just copy this data and I will edit this data. 
so this is the same data that i imported so now what i have done when i have combined the fields so i'm just renaming it uh, putting a name to my fields just to give you an idea what actually tableau is doing so here what actually is doing if you are familiar with excel you may know that there is an option in excel which say concatenate which combine the uh, variables so if i draw and do that concatenate and then this is the first variable state and then it's uh, adding the second variable but it's also adding a comma so in order to add a comma in excel i will be using inverted commas then comma and close then my second variable which is the region and then close so now you can see that if you go to here state and region actually tableau while combining while using that combined option tableau have taken the alabama state and then added a comma and then added this second variable which is the region and put it all the information from the two variables into a single variable for our use and now if i go back to my tableau and now if i add population here and now you can see that it, now if i sort this variable if i, if I select the sub population i will say largest to uh, smallest then you can see that now i able to create a table in which i can show the information related to the state and the region and now i can stay and i can sort it based on the overall data not uh, just based on each region category so this way that's why the combine option become very useful in such case of scenarios and i will now give you another uh, scenario in which i will be creating a two-way table and then i will show that how you can use combine option there too so let's suppose if i want to create again a uh, state so uh, first i will go for region then state in the rows and now suppose if i want to create a two-way table and there is an also a status variable which is dividing uh, the data into uh, uh, telling us the that which states are rich and which states are poor so if i also add that into column and now if i add my population variable in the end so in this case again if if you want to see those uh, region state and uh, uh, status variable states which are uh having the maximum population here in in this table the sorting becomes more uh, difficult you can't do it uh, even if you add suppose if you want to add want to see that uh, highlight those numbers in which the population is high and you can also do that if you add it here but here you can see that those numbers which are more brighter means that the, the population is higher in those uh, states but this table is very hard to uh, analyze you can't uh, analyze it properly so in that case again you can use the combine option again not just for two variables here we will be using the combine option for three variables and then we will be able to sort and highlight those uh, states region and status uh, by sorting the table so now what i will go i will go to sheet four and now what i will do again i will select my region variable state variable and status variable i have selected three variables and then i will right click it and then i will say create i will say combine fields so now this is the variable they have created i have i will be using that under rows and now i can drag this population to here and now if i select this variable i can easily sort my data and you can see that this combined field is showing me the south uh, that the this state is in the south and the state name is florida and it's a poor state and then it's what is the population this is me showing me that i can sort this table very easily and i can focus my analysis suppose if i just want to focus on the states which are having uh, the highest uh, population and even what i can do i can add this variable here from here into the filters and then i can easily select my states here too 
that which are the states I want to select. So this is all about that how you can uh, use the combine option in Tableau and how you can uh, sort your tables more easily by using the combine option in Tableau. Thank you for watching the video.